Altiviniao. I'm a Dutch designer. I'm presenting my couture collections here in Paris. Um, and this season uh, I showed a collection that was much more fluid and much more soft and feminine. And I liked to, liked to balance the masculine part and the feminine part. So we used the hard materials, the shell-like materials, against this really fluid, soft, feminine part. So uh, the inspiration came from this Barbarella kind of period. Uh, I looked a lot of these on these photos, so that's where the color combinations came from that I really was so enthusiastic about how they painted the black and white that kind of feel into it. But then adding this masculine uh, hip structure uh, parts into it, because in that period the male figures were also really visually very sexually dressed. They even had shorter skirts than the women had on. So I really like this playing with these two elements in this collection, and that's why we also added the helmets to it and to make them these larger than life goddesses. I always liked this moment of coming out more or less, so, and it's what you have on a stage of course, uh, but you also have it if you dressed up for the day and you went out. So that's why I always liked this feel of going this extra mile that they used to do in the old days, like with all the embroideries and all the detailing. So I always take this extra step, so that's why it's, you know, it takes this step higher in just being different. So we have the underlayer here so you see of so the this sequins. Is, so this is much brighter, so then it's really hard, so it's nice when you cover it. Mm -hmm. So it becomes again, once you move it gets shiny and then less, so the same that we did here. So you have this shininess, but you still have the, it's the dew. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So and this is a, a, a nice capsule in a way. It's just a playful. It's gorgeous. Yeah. That's a hot cat suit. Yeah. I could see Beyonce wearing that. Yeah, me too. I would love to see her wear it. Because I think it would enhance her figure really nicely. Mm -hmm. And you can move quite easily in it. So it's, it's just a beautiful fun piece. And it's nice the layering that we did with the paillettes. So you get the coloring, mm -hmm. right? So this one is softer. Mm -hmm. And this one is harder because we used a more brighter mm -hmm. silver. So mm -hmm. it changed the color. And this is a more. Um, Matte? Matte, yeah. Matte, so we mm -hmm. had the matte going from matte mm -hmm. into this whole turquoise mm -hmm. feel. It's beautiful to see all the colors mixed in with your collection. With this dress, they had the, the helmets on when they came on and then they took them off. And then this really long, wavy hair fell out of the helmet. And I find it this really beautiful gesture that only women can do. They can, you know, they can come on really strong and then you're really more or less intimidated by them and then they take it off and then you have suddenly they become this fluent, soft, disarming kind of figure. So that's why what I really wanted to do is have them coming on really strong and then take, doing this beautiful gesture of showing themselves and revealing themselves again. So that was the whole uh, playfulness in the show, like right? mm -hmm. having them come on really protective and then disarming themselves and saying, okay, I'm showing myself, I'm re revealing myself to mm -hmm. um, The first collection I showed here was 2007, okay. I think. If I'm, if five I'm, years in. Five years in. So that, that's, uh, how do you say? It's a, been a great experience. So we started here and took small steps and the fun part now is also like you have Lady Gaga wearing it, Beyonce had the shoes on on her CD cover. So those are all these fun elements, you have all these requests now coming in that, are, that is interesting. And now we're also taking the next step, for example, with the shoes, is getting next season we were presenting our shoe line, so we also have more. I always like putting women on this high pedestal, so that's why I always liked to do, when I was studying at the academy, I already placed them on this, yeah, this little pedestal, so that's why I always work with. So these were, I really wanted to have this like small tiny feet and this way that it, the balancing act like if you see them from behind you still see the heel but it feels like it's moving into the foot so it, it had this ballerine kind of feel going into it and this yeah this awkward yeah what the ballerine also had the ballerine, exactly this, this moving keeping pointed. balance pointed 
but also there's still this softness into it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're very feminine. So can you tell me a little bit about your collaborations with Lady Gaga? How did that start and what have you been working with her on? The collaboration with her are really fun because she's such an icon and she's such a strong person in getting this acceptance across of, okay, well, I will be the most loudest and so you will be, will be accepted. So that's what I really loved about her. And uh, so we, she first wore a piece of mine when she was uh, here in Paris and uh, then I got a phone call right after the show last season uh, and she said, okay, I wanted to have you design a dress for me for my next uh, video clip. So I designed the dress and I, went, I did a few sketches and then she said, well, oh, can you do two? So then we had two dresses made for her and the shoes made for her uh, and they were in the video clip so we're really excited about it. Now, what videos did, are we going to be looking for that where Lady Gaga's wearing your clothes? Oh, that I don't know. I don't. Do you know the names of the videos? I don't think it's top secret for the most yeah. time. <laughs> top, secret. top secret. For the time top secret. Video. So we just have to keep a lookout so it's, for Lady it's Gaga good to keep and a your. Out. Yes, exactly. Yeah, that's always the fun. Exactly, and Beyonce. She has your shoes and her new. Uh, she had, had on the, the latest album. She had on. Oh, okay, she great. was wearing the high oh, platform. So, brilliant. So, brilliant. And she did a great job wearing it. I'm, well, yeah. <laughs> it's not easy, so that's no. good. Cool, well I can't wait to look forward to that. Yeah, Brilliant. Thank, thank you. you so much. Thank you.